for the channel. So in this particular video, we will guide you how to fix all of runtime application encounter and error during this operation. So how to fix it? So let's start it. So where are the first fix? We have to do check DLC list dot x file permission. So you have to simply go into your file manager and navigate to your users, then journal and then going to app data. And then after we have to go to local or a follow up port. And after this, you have to locate that DLC list dot text file. Right click on the this link and select properties and we will ensure the read only attribute is not checked. If it is a check, you have to click apply. Alternatively, you can try deleting the DLC list file or a rename to it something else, such as DLC list two dot text. Okay, if this is first option. We have to move to fix. So locate the installer. Ensure you are looking in the correct directory for the installer file. If you cannot find the installer dot exe in the phone folder, we have to double check the folder. So we are the fix three. We have to run the installer as end Find the installer.exe pipe in front of fallout magnet fallout folder and now right click on the installer.exe and select run as administrator. After this, we have to run the installer as administrator and add bypass permission issue that might be causing that. So we are the fix for each your sufficient text space. But if I that you have enough this space in available on your drive where fallout learner is being installed. If you initially download did not have enough space and have since we have some attempt to run the installer again. Okay, so this is fixed. So that's how you can resolve this problem by following the, this solution. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you understand how you can resolve it.